as the disciples were gazing up towards heaven, angels appeared unto them and said, This same Jesus, which is taken up from you into heaven, shall so come in like manner as you have seen him go into heaven. This is your daily devotional, Maranatha, the Lord is coming, with Sister Tanya Nugis. Maranatha, page 50, Searching Questions, February 11th. Who shall ascend into the hill of the Lord, or who shall stand in his holy place? He that hath clean hands and a pure heart, who hath not lifted up his soul unto vanity, nor sworn deceitfully. Psalms 24, 3 and 4. A soul united with Christ will war against all transgression and every approach of sin. He becomes every day more like a bright and shining light and more victorious. He goes on from strength to strength, not from weakness to weakness. Let no one deceive his own soul in this matter. If you harbor pride, self-esteem, a love for the supremacy, vainglory, unholy ambition, murmuring, discontent, bitterness, evil speaking, lying, deception, slandering, you have not Christ abiding in your heart. You must have a Christian character that will stand. There must be through conversions among those who claim to believe the truth, or they will fall in the day of trial. God's people must reach a high standard. They must be a holy nation, a peculiar people, a chosen generation, zealous of good works. Christ has not died for you that you may possess the passions, tastes, and habits of men of the world. No man enters the portals of glory, but he who sets his heart thitherward. Then let the question come home. Do you mind earthly things? Are your thoughts pure? Are you breathing the atmosphere of heaven? Do you carry with you the miasma of pollution? Are you earnest and devoted, serving God with purity and in beauty of holiness? Ask sincerely, am I a child of God or am I not? We need a thorough reformation in all our churches. The converting power of God must come into the church. Put not off the day of preparation. Slumber not in a state of unpreparedness, having no oil in your vessels with your lamps. Let not the question remain in perilous uncertainty. Ask yourselves earnestly, am I among the saved or the unsaved? Shall I stand, or shall I not stand? He only that hath clean hands and a pure heart shall stand in that day. It is a privilege of every son of God to be a true Christian moment by moment. Then he has all heaven enlisted on his side. This has been your daily devotional with Sister Tanya Nuges. Maranatha, Jesus is coming again. Get ready, get ready, get ready.